Hello guys! In this video I'll show you how to use the third and last kit of the Christmas giveaway which features the Pit Monochrome set by Faber-Castell. You'll get a set of 12 pieces in a metal box in which you'll find a description of the company and the tools in the box. The kit contains of 4 pastels in the colors white, sepia, sanguine and black. You will also find three pastel pencils in white sepia sanguine, one oil-based pencil in black, one charcoal pencil, a standard pencil and a pure graphite for professional sketching. There is also of course a kneaded eraser, a tortillon for blending and three sheets of colored paper. The kneaded eraser is a pliable eraser which can be shaped by hand for precision erasing, but it's not well suited for completely erasing large areas. Its function is to absorb and pick up the graphite by dabbing it off the paper. This way you can lighten up any dark areas. Once it's dirty, you can just knead it like this and it cleans itself. To demonstrate how to use the tools of the set, I'll use my own collection of pastels and apply the colors on two different types of paper. The one on the left is with a smooth surface, the one on the right has a tooth to it. If you want to blend the colors, although it's not necessary, you can use a tortillon or your fingers. The oil-based pencils are harder to smudge than the soft ones, and it's advisable to place a clean sheet of paper between your hand and the drawing itself while illustrating, because you'll smear the colors with your palm. I didn't use a clean sheet under my hand this time, and you will be able to see how messy my drawing got on the right hand side. And here are some of my drawings made in the same technique by using monochrome pastels. After I pre-sketched the motif with a regular graphite pencil, I used a kneaded eraser to remove any harsh lines which can be visible under the pastels. As I don't have the same pastels from the box, I'll use sepia and sanguine pastels from another brand, but the end effect will be pretty much the same, I promise. The technique of using monochrome colors, black, white, sanguine and sepia, dates back to the Renaissance. This old technique is used and taught to date in life drawing classes at almost every art school. These colors bring pictures to life with vitality and expression. And this is how it works. Most of artists use colored paper in earth tones for their monochrome drawings. The real color of the paper is used for highlight or mid-tone, enhanced with white, while the shadows are deepened with black. If you are a beginner and if you don't know where to start, ask yourself which areas are hit by the light and apply white on those. These will be mostly convex shapes which reflect light. Repeat the same with the areas in shadow and apply black. Then use a finger or a tortillon to slightly blend out the white and black. And you have just probably managed your first detail of your illustration. The amazing thing about this technique is that it's actually playing with your brain. You wonder how? Well, what we do here is actually just hint some highlights and shadows. But our brain uses the areas of blank paper to complete the image in our mind. Because this is how we actually experience shapes. Our brain complements what's missing. How amazing is this? The trick is to apply just enough color in certain areas. Your brain manages the rest.
Once you are done with the drawing, it's important to set the pigment by spraying it with a fixative for charcoals or soft pastels. It will secure that the pigment doesn't fall off or smear and it will prevent the colors from fading. I heard of some people using hairspray instead, so I gave it a try, but the colors changed a bit by spraying. As there is a huge interest in all three sets, I decided to extend the giveaway until December 27th, so you'll have enough time to see what's in the third set and decide which one you want to win. All you need to do is click on this link, become a subscriber to my channel, choose your favorite video from my channel and share it on your website or social network. And of course, don't forget to tell me in the comments below which set you want to win. For more information about the prizes and how to enter my giveaway, go to my video. I want to thank you guys for your support in the last year and I want to wish you wonderful holidays full of joy, peace and love. May all your dreams come true, enjoy the Christmas spirit and don't forget to subscribe to my channel to get updates on any new um, tutorials and giveaways like this one. So I'll see you next time on our next adventure. Bye!